Hello friends, this is Ishwar here and in this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Pixel Experience Android 8.1 Oreo ROM on the Redmi Note 4. So, let's get started. First of all, we need to get into Chrome browser and download the ROM from the website. It's available on HD developers. I will leave the link in the description box below. If it doesn't load for the first time, just reload it and it will give you the download links for you to download. Just tap on the primary download link so that it will download even more faster than the other links. Now we need to download the 8.1 G apps. The ROM already includes the gaps but if you want different gaps then you can download it from here. This is an Aroma installer so it will give you a graphic interface to, for you to select the gaps to install. Next, take a local backup with the default MIUI's local backup option so that if anything goes wrong we can restore from it. It just backups your settings, your apps and app data so that whenever you install a MIUI ROM again you can restore it with the help of that. Next, also take your backup for your social media and stuff like WhatsApp so that you can restore it from your Google Drive account so when you install the WhatsApp on your newest ROM. Next, turn off your phone. Now, after turning it off, Press the volume up and the power button simultaneously to get into the recovery of your phone. I am using a TWRP based recovery but it's not a complete TWRP. It's a based it's based on TWRP. It is optimized for Redmi Note 4. As you can see it is saying that it is a Red Wolf TWRP. It is optimized for Redmi Note 4 so that we can use it seamlessly. If you want to take a backup, you can take a backup so that we can restore if anything goes wrong and we will get as it is as our old ROM so that we need not do any the new new thing to install. Now let us select wipe, select advanced wipe, dial leak, dial leak system data and catch now swipe to wipe now the interface may be different in different TWRPs but the concept is the same you need to wipe what all I have wiped here and now we need to get back and then tap on install now I have the pixel experience here is that pixel experience below 8.1.0 on the date so tap on it and then install it so it may take uh, take a few minutes so we just need to wait for it to complete it is actually good from it gives you a pixel experience which is which is awesome you get that pixel too and to excel experience now I will install it and then we'll show you how it is here is the progress bar let us wait for it to complete it says that script succeeded result was 1.0 now let's get back select the open gaps 8.1 aroma I'm trying this for the first time this gaps aroma package so let's just try it out oh this gives this gaps graphic interface gives you a different thing now I think I need to select next and then we need to install the complete installation maybe We can install the gaps. 
wait for it to install and then we will reboot the system and we will experience the ROM and some users also say that the rebooting time on this ROM is very super fast so let us try that out that one too now this is installed let's click next then let's it is saying that reboot your device now let's take that and then click finish now yeah we we'll just reboot the device I think we will get a pixel boot up screen let's wait and see yeah it's a good thing now let's check the boot up timing I think we need to wait for some more time now this one is installed let's go and set up this one yeah, it's asking for the fingerprint. I will set fin pin plus fingerprint. Oh, I'm just locating it. Yeah, here's your Google Assistant. You know, I feel that this is great looking actually because the black one, the Redmi Note 4 actually looks good, and that with this ROM, it's too good. Now I have got to the screen. I will select the pixel launcher and set always. As you can see, the wallpaper is awesome. The pixel icons here and the notification center. You get that. It's it's really awesome. I press the power button. Can you see that? I like that very much. Let me bring down the brightness and show you. The power button. When you press the power button, you get these right here, not at the middle of the screen, and it will be easily accessible like this. So that's all for today's video. Thank you and have a great day. Like this and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you.